Hey guys, Super Godzilla Final Wars here, and today we're back with another Godzilla figure review. So today we're going to be reviewing Kong himself. So without further ado, let's get started. Oh, I forgot. There we go. <laughs> so I'm going to go over his accessories, starting with his Battle Axe. Now, when I... I'm pretty sure when people saw this, at first they thought it was just like two rocks sticking out of the axe, but when the figures themselves were released, the people got a good look at it, they, they realized, wait a minute, that looks like Godzilla's dorsal spine. Did Kong ripped off Godzilla's dorsal spine? Plus, I think we saw it in the film, I mean in the trailer, that... It was clearly Godzilla's, well, dorsal spine that was more like the main axe itself. And I'm still having trouble to figure out which part, which part of the dorsal spine it is. Like, like I'm having trouble to figure out if if it's like this one, this bottom one here, or this big one right. Or this big one right there. Or that small one. But, let me know in the comments below. Which dorsal spine do you think is, well, the axe? Which dorsal spine do you think it is? Because I'm having trouble figuring out what it, which spine that is. Anyways, the battle axe looks cool. Looks really, really cool. Even though I'm not a big fan of King Kong, but I will admit, this battle axe does look really cool. And people even say that that this part of the axe is more like a Mudo's like like a Mudo's leg, and it makes sense because the Mudos are capable of stopping Godzilla's atomic breath from happening. <clears throat> and people make theories that the Kongs. Killed a few Mudos and used their legs to stop the atomic breath from hitting them. And of course, this gave them their opportunity to kill a few Godzillas and therefore getting this part of the axe. Therefore, they made the ultimate weapon that's more capable of killing Godzilla. But Enough with the axe, moving on to Monkey Boy himself. So, let's go over his articulation. He has a buttload of articulation. Not as much as the SH Monster Arts version, but... His hands can move, move, his arm can move, his head can move, and his legs can also move, and I think his feet can move as well. No. And, uh, just like the other two figures, he also has a little battle damage. But it's very difficult to take it off. Like, come on, get out of there. There we go. There, see? I still thought that Godzilla vs. Kong was going to be a lot more... The more bloody and all gore and all that stuff, but nope. And it and this is a pain in the butt to put back on. Like I would show you, but my camera does not like to stand up, so I'll just have to do it like this. But if you guys have this figure and you try to take the thing off and put it back on, okay, maybe okay. This time it was kind to me and just decided to go easy. Just, yeah. So, moving on for detailing, I will say, hey, the detailing, not as great in comparison to the Bandai and the SH Monster Arts counterpart, but it's still good, it's still good in my opinion. And since Kong is roaring, and since, well, this figure is more like a roaring Kong, Everyone is always like put like Play-Doh over the mouth to like cover his mouth and all that stuff or 
use the other figure to be a more like his closed mouth and when it comes to having him go in battle they just have him go all roaring and all that stuff and all you know so obviously this figure looks good you can clearly see that this figure is not all that bad the and this Kong is also the biggest incarnation of Kong, so, yeah. And the Battle Axe. You can put the Battle Axe on, but I think everyone can only, I think everyone can agree with me on when it came to the Battle Axe. Axe, it's like, really hard to put on. And, there. So... Here's Kong, holding his battle axe. So, yeah. So, yeah. So, bringing in the size comparison here is the Playmates Kong with the Barapasaurus from Schleich. As, as you can see, just like Godzilla, he is obviously taller. And the Barapasaurus, but in real out, but in re but in reality, this guy will be way bigger than this guy. So yeah. So that is it for the Godzilla vs. That's it for the Playmates Godzilla vs. Kong, Kong with Battle Axe. So yeah, hope you guys like this video. Like, comment, subscribe. Don't forget to have a man, Gorgera, with excellence. I'll see you in my next video. Bye-bye.